All right, so let's go over an example for uh, final exam number eight. All right, so what we want to do is we want to find y prime or dy over dx uh, using implicit differentiation. All right, so let's do that. All right, so we need to take the derivative of this. Uh, so by taking a derivative uh, with respect to x, we'll get right, 8 is just a constant, so you just put that there, right? Derivative of e to the y is e to the y, but we have to multiply by, since we're taking a derivative with respect to x, we have to put uh, y, uh, multiply by y prime or dy over dx. Uh, since they're using y prime, I'm going to use y prime here, right? It's equal to, right? Derivative of x cubed is just the regular derivative, so 3 in front, x to the uh, second power, x squared, All right? So negative y to the fourth. Now this is written in y, so we have to do a chain rule. So it's negative 4 y to the uh, qy cubed, then multiply by y prime, All right? So uh, we can simplify. Let's see. I'm going to move uh, this term right here to the other side by adding by adding a full y cubed times y prime. Right. So you get. Uh, so you're going to have uh, eight e to the y y prime, which is this guy. Now we're adding 4y cubed times y prime, and is equal to, we still have 3x squared, 3x squared, right? So since uh, y prime is it is in both terms on the left we can factor out the y prime right then what's left is right 8 e to the y so 8 e to the y and plus 4 y cubed this is equal to 3x squared. All right? Then we divide through by quantity 8e to the y minus full y cubed. You get the y prime to be 3x squared over 8 e to the y plus 4y cubed, right? So uh, this is the answer. I'll just uh, write that here. Just boxed it in. All right, so this is y prime. And if you want to evaluate this y prime at uh, 2 comma 0, so all you have to do is uh, plug in 2 for x and plug in 0 for y. All right, so let's do that. So it's going to be uh, 2 here, so it's uh, 3 times, right, 2 is plug in, x is 2 and squared divided by 8 times e to the y is 0, e to the 0 plus 4 times y is 0, 0 cubed. All right, uh, e to the 0 is 1. So you will get, uh, let's see, uh, there's, uh, let's say 2 times 2 is 4. And then divide by, uh, this is 0, so you can just ignore that. And uh, so that's going to be 2. So you see that that's a 3 over 2. So 3 halves is the answer. All right, that's it.
i hope that that this was clear.